After clearing the dark chocolate from around the mush. Right. Gel mask, that's cool, isn't it? Alright, basically, at half two in the morning last night, I heard a noise. And basically, the hamster escaped. And this is where it was. She. And I managed to get her out. She's called Sheila now. Because the kids couldn't sign her name, so I called the hamster Sheila. Sheila! Um, a bit tired. Well, I'm not too tired, but I've got a bang in a day. Took about an hour to get her out of the floorboards. And in this cupboard behind me was all of this. So we couldn't sleep in the bed, so we had to sleep in the living room. Anyway, yes, Chloe, come and talk to me. The Just the floorboards down here, darling. Do you want to? Do you want to talk onto this video about, on this XJW thing about your dream you had last night and how it upset you? No. No? Well. Okay. So the hamster was down there? Yep, she was. Go on then, off you go, so I make a video. Yep. Good girl. You had your pizza? Mm -hmm. Good. So. That daughter. You're listening. Be downstairs. She was really upset. <clears throat> Went down this morning. She was crying in her mum's arms. Um, basically, she has um, the boiler dying. She was crying because she had a dream about the kingdom hall and all the people there. All the old uncles and aunties. And how she now feels. She's sad. She misses them. So get to explain to them how, you know, how they've lied. They lied to us then, they were fake then, and they didn't really love us in the way that someone should do. And accept you for who you are, you have to be better. So yeah, she was upset because we couldn't go on Zoom because there was a feeder file on there. And the elders said, well, if you don't want to be on there, then you have to listen on the link or just have you and your wife on there without the kids. As you all know before, the same story, but this thing keeps coming round. My little girl is sobbing her heart out because she misses her aunties and uncles who basically lied and the ones who did the worst lies, basically. The elder that told me that the paedophile was having thoughts about children still struggles with it. Uh, is the one we were telling for about a year that we were having, we were struggling at the meet to get to the means because it was just so hard knowing he was there. Turns out he hadn't told any of the other elders, which I assumed he had. And when the others elders found out, they were shocked and said, well, "Why haven't? Why all of a sudden are you upset about it now?" And we said, "Well, we, it's been a long time. Um, we assumed that elders communicated, and obviously, this hadn't been done." And yeah, she's upset. They upset her when she found out she couldn't do her item on Zoom. And the difference with Zoom in the, in the hall, she could have done her item in the hall. Which, oh, I do tell you what, we think we would have left eventually anyway with him there. But with online, you can take snap, you know, take the, he could have had it set to a space bar, take screenshots, could have been videoing it, or whatever else. Don't think what a paedophile is doing online. The thing I know about this paedophile, he's been to prison. He just before he came to our congregation, he was on the sex offenders list. He got taken off just before he came to ours. And I know for a fact he went on holiday to Thailand just before he came to our congregation. The things that I've heard is that he was on a tag, um, that he went to Thailand, and I'm not even sure he's been to Thailand again since when he first joined. Um, and yeah, so. Poor girl, I've upset my daughter. She cried when she couldn't do her item on there. And that was the last straw for me, I think. You know, that was about. I had to upset my kids, and uh, now she's still having dreams about it. Two dreams, she'd have the same dream twice. Uh, she cries, she's really upset, and like, as you've just seen, I just asked if she wanted to talk about it in the camera. She says no, because it's too upsetting for her. So thank you, all you uh, fake JWs. 
Anyway, I've got this all to clean up. I managed to catch the hamster. We're tired. Hope you're all good. Thanks for your comments and subscribers. Be who you are and ignore, ignore the truth. Um, what else can I say? That's about it for today. Until maybe later. That's it. It's my old daughter's upset, crying still. So this is what the truth. That's what the the um, the lie does to you. That's what the organisation does. I'm hoping I can bring out some some people that are still in in that religion. Hopefully, I can bring them out. Um, yeah. Well, yeah. For you, for you Americans as well. There was an American witness came to our hall and I said, little girl, and I said to her, what do you like, to like about England? She said, well, what's Daddy, different? She said, everything's so small. Thank you. Downstairs, yeah. This is our biggest bedroom. So I don't know if to you Americans that's small. But you can see, I made that bed head out of pallet wood the other day. It's pretty cool. And it's a bit of a mess, mainly because the cupboard came out at half in the morning. I think the neighbours are a bit, probably a bit upset with us. But there we go. That's the, uh, the difference is I don't really care anymore too much because I'm not a witness and I haven't got to say we shouldn't do this because of the Jehovah's Witnesses. We just get on with our lives. And if you don't like it then tough luck because well that's the way it is um you put up things from both sides of neighbors and they're quite they say quite nasty things sometimes hurtful things without thinking about it and um i put up with it for a long time so i bite back a bit now because uh it's nice being nice but not being walked over see you later people have a nice day